Alright, so. The goal for today is to, one, clean up all this caulk mess I made. Two, make a rod rack um, for the kayak. We're going to go from hole to hole, and it's going to kind of 45 back, and then 90 this way. So then it's going to have uh, five ports on top. Four that'll hold four rods, and then it'll hold my GoPro in the middle. So, but we gotta go get some supplies. So, that is what we're doing for today. It all fell down there, but we got it. So as you can tell this isn't taking very long. All right, so, got it all dry fit. Um, just gotta take it off and glue it all and then uh, I'm gonna paint it black. This here is just to show you, this is um, what the GoPro is actually gonna mount to now. I used to put my tripod up, but it's gonna mount to that now. I gotta cut it 
to the length I need and it'll be center behind me at the perfect height so but yeah that's it um, I'm about 15 minutes in so then I just gotta glue it and paint it so I don't know maybe a total of 30 minutes gives you four rod holders and a GoPro mount or five rod holders and then I mean technically I, I made it to where I could still get into my hatch but if you don't have a hatch or even if I mean you can still get in there but put you could put um, some more down here if you wanted to get even more rods but all right well that's it okay so here's the finished product it's painted I still haven't got rid of my caulk on my hatches yet but the rod holder is painted the pieces that I want glued are glued and my GoPro mount is there so what I did for the GoPro mount is I put a fitting down here I put a a male fitting and a female fitting that way I can actually just just unscrew the whole thing that way it's actually I didn't want to glue it but I didn't want it to be loose to where it could come out so just screws into there and I used a um, a, uh, a coupling and a flat cap and drilled a hole in it put a quarter 20 in there which screws into the GoPro mount so there it is now I can put four rods in there and have my GoPro mounted still got room for my wheels and my scupper holes back here so there it is there it is took me about total 30 35 minutes with painting and everything it's just one coat well all right thanks for watching